Once, you said that a photon doesn't experience time. It's born and immediately is destroyed. If a photon from somewhere in the galaxy is born, and over time, it redshifts as we know photons do. How can it both experience a redshift, but also be destroyed immediately after creation? That's a great question. It really I, is. I don't, I don't know that I have a good answer for that, because that's how it is. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's how photons roll, okay? <laughs> so what he's saying is, if the photon that's emitted right. is different, different from the, the photon, photon that, that you detected right. or destroyed at the end of its path, then something happened to the photon. So if something happened to the photon, the photon has to be temporarily aware of that right. in some way. Right. Wow, you asked that question better than he did. <laughs> I'm, I'm, thinking that's, I'm thinking that's what he means. I'm right. pretty, that pretty makes sure. sense. No, pretty no, sure. Yeah. So we see this. The question is, what does the photon think happens?